Hey everybody, my name is JJ and I am back to recording Let's Plays. Now it's been a few weeks since I recorded my last one. I don't know how long it's been, three weeks, maybe more. But, and the reason I've been away is because I was releasing my latest novel. Now I'm an independent author, which means that when you release your novel, a novel, you have to do all the work yourself, which means that not only do you have to write the novel, but then you have to find an editor for the novel. You have to find a cover artist and get them to do all that stuff. Then you have to get it all organized. And then before you can publish it on Amazon, which is where I publish my, my books, um, you have to make sure you meet their, uh, their stringent guidelines, etc., etc. And then after you release it, of course, you have to try and get it out to as many eyeballs as, as humanly possible, which for, in my case is not a lot, but I do have an email list and I've sent that off and I've I hope a little word of mouth will help me too. Anyway, so uh, I'm going to leave a picture, put up a picture of my uh, of my cover because I'm very proud of it. And uh, if you want to check out my work, that's up to you, of course. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description below to my author page. And uh, anyway, that's enough of that. So I am back, and we are going to be playing Drunjin, Dungeons of Ink and Paper. And I like to look at this little game. I haven't played it yet. This is my first uh, time I've opened the game. And basically, it's all done in a 2D uh, ink and paper style. So all the monsters are 2D, the NPCs are 2D, everything's 2D. It's, I don't think it's a very big game, maybe a few hours long, but it's also not a very expensive game, which is a plus for me because I am on a very limited budget, and that's why I don't play a lot of the AAA games very often because they're expensive. Anyway, so uh, enough of that. We're going to get into it, start playing again because I'm uh, way overdue to, to put up a net Let's Play. And I hope you come along and enjoy the uh, enjoy the show. Are you ready? Here we go. And here we are. And uh, again, I don't know anything about this game. But anyway, so I picked a wizard because I almost always pick a wizard. And we are, all I can see is what you can see. I'm just moving around with the mouse. I assume you can see my little finger on the screen. And I've got paper intelligence plus four, <laughs> whatever that means. That's my little guy, class wizard, level one, whoops, health points, experience points, none, so I haven't done anything yet. Intelligence three, of course, magic papers. I don't know anything about this game. Uh, and we're in, I assume, the starting. I could use a uh, controller, but I'm going to use a um, mouse and keyboard. Handle the wizard in front of you, nameplate. Okay, that's good. And we've got artifacts, scroll of teleportation, cost seven. Okay, I've got that now. I don't know what I'm doing, which is fun, I guess. Okay, so you fight with uh, the, the right mouse click. <laughs> I don't know. So inscription, teller is to the east, picked up teleportation. Um, all right. So you turn with E and Q, which is totally uh, not intuitive, but that's fine. I'll deal with it. And we're just straight into the dungeon, I guess. I don't know anything about it. There's a nice little map there on the upper right, so I guess that's good. And then we go and see how badly, uh, quickly I can fail. I really think I should be able to turn better with the mouse, but that's fine. All right, here we go. Hello. Well, maybe we're not in the dungeon yet. Who are you? Move, 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 for God's sakes, move. Uh, great. Okay, hello. Okay, please get rid of these spiders in our houses. Oh, I guess I'm outside. It looks like I'm in a dungeon already, but okay. Spiders in your houses, you say. Hello, who are you? Dealer, ink. I don't know what any of this does. It's teleportation, I get. Paper, intelligence plus four. What does that even mean? Living water. <laughs> nice shovel of the necromancer. That's a weapon, I guess. Do I have a weapon? I don't have any weapons. I don't need gold. I don't have anything. Okay. Well, fun. Right. Continue. All right. Here we go. I don't know where I'm going or what I'm doing. It's a tree. Or is it? Skill tree. Oh, that's cute. That's fun. Okay. Expand inventory. Blah, 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 blah. Right. Well, whatever. Okay. I don't really have anything to do with that right now because, of course, I haven't got any skills. I haven't got anything. Can I go in? The door is closed. Well, how do I open the door? Um, okay. Can I fight the door? <laughs> Your controls are on the bottom right, which I didn't even notice until just now, so that's fun. 
The door is closed, the door is closed, the door is closed. Well, you said to get rid of the spiders. How am I supposed to do that if your doors are closed? That's just silly. Okay, and again, the door is closed. What am I missing here? Oh, there we go. Hey, hello. Hut of the wizard. It's a spider. Oh, look at these guys. These are, these are fun. Ah, I gotta tear the web down. Okay. Attack. Ow. Ow. Oh. Oh my god, when they die, they t they sound like uh, tearing paper. Ow. 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 Two hit points left. I'm almost dead. Great. Well, this is going off to a, starting off to a... <laughs> it's a rousing start is what I mean to say. Okay, so I got, uh, I got that. Can I heal at all? I don't even know. Um, what does this even do? I don't even know what this does. Oh, you're supposed to equip it. Oh, God. Okay. Two hit points. How do I heal? Why am I holding this in my hand, by the way? <laughs> well, there's some chests. That's a good thing. All right. Nice bow of the night. Thank you. And what else? An arrow. Okay. Well, I can use the bow and arrow. Wrong slot. There we go. Okay. So I can shoot now. Wish I'd seen that earlier before I lost all my hit points. Great. All right. So that's it for this place. Let's move on. As I awkwardly try to move around. Okay. Handle of the wizard. What the hell? What is that? I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. Well, this is fun. What a lovely place. Oh, nice tree skull. Is that like the, like the power of gray skull? Nice. What's this? Door is locked, key 777. Right. Okay, I'll just, I'll, I'll get right on that. Hello, mushroom. What does a mushroom do? I don't know. Oh, heals some hit points. I'm guessing. I don't know. Let's see. Maybe I'm stoned out of my mind now. There's a mushroom. Maybe it'll kill me. Nope, healed me. That's good. And you are... What are you? Who the hell are you? Whoop. Mushroom of teleportation. Just what I've always wanted. So, whoop. Mushroom of teleportation. Mushroom. Okay, let's have another mushroom. Because what could go wrong? Still. Okay. All right. We are healing up. I know this is taking forever. and uh, But it's brand new to me. So, you know. I'm just glad there's some way to heal yourself. Okay. Full hit, hit points. Full health. And yeah, lots of mushrooms. Normally, I'd be afraid of mushrooms, but apparently they're okay in this in this game. Lots of mushrooms of teleportation for some reason. Apparently, I'm going to have to teleport a lot. Okay, can I get in here? Oh, I can. Okay. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah, this isn't creepy at all. All right. I wish there was some music. If there's music, I can't hear it. I'll give you the name to the title of the song, actually. If there's music, I can't hear Oh, look, a bat. Whoop. I should get closer, I suppose. Hero is dead. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Shall we go again? Of course we shall. Here we go. <laughs> How about uh, sex? Yeah, male, because why not? So either a warrior, a wizard, or a trickster, which is a thief. Okay, maybe I should just try a warrior. Why, why get fancy about it, right? Okay, so I got a sword. Put it in the slot. Uh, chicken. What? Meta points. Oh, I got meta points when I died from the last one. Okay. What, is, what, is, what does that mean? Sphere of experience. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, all right. Double axe, sword, sphere. 
Not enough gold. I have to have gold? It says meta points. Okay, cost. I have no gold. Do I? No. If I do, I can't see it. Alright. Well, meta points. Maybe meta points are gold. <laughs> Buy gold. There. That was a good purchase. Apparently, I bought some gold. One go cost of gold, one gold. <laughs> what? Why is a chicken 33? Why do I need a chicken? Do I need a chicken? Anyway, whatever. Moving on. Okay, here we go. Let's try this yet again. Okay, so we got our three scrolls of teleportation. And we're in a town, not in a dungeon. And off we go. Now. Hello. Please get rid of these spiders. Can I go in here? I can. Okay. Aha. I have you now. Hey, nice. Okay. Good start. Is that the only one? Fantastic. That's a good way to start. A reasonable hat of the necromancer. Intelligence plus... Well, I'm not a necromancer. I'm a warrior. Apparently. Epic diadem of the illusionist. Wow. This stuff worse than anything? Must be worth something. What do I... Okay. Should I put it on? Is it going to help? I don't think so. Oh, well. It's something. You don't have a very big... Uh, if that's your all your um, space you have in your pack, that's not a lot. Anyway. Okay, so is that all that's in here? Okay. I love the fact that when you hit something, it sounds like paper tearing. Because that's what it is. That's cool. Okay. We're out. Yay. Do you love me now? I'm a hero, apparently. So that guy over there is a vendor, I think. Okay, so... I see you, spider. Yes, I do. Oh, you're running away from the big bad knight. Or whatever. Ha-ha! Dead. You hit me, but you're dead. Okay, what's in here? A bat. Okay, you hit me too, but you're also dead. And that's all that matters. Okay. So we got a chest, and we have not enough free space. That's what we have. Oh, for God's sake. All right. So I better go and sell something and come back. It is a cute game, don't you think? I mean, it's, you know, it's very simplistic, but it's also... Um, Quite original. Okay. Throw an item at me and I'll give you some gold. Oh! There you go. That's how it's done. Well, that's one way to do it, right? That's how you sell your stuff. Basically, give it to this guy and he eats it and gives you gold for it. Thank you. That's fantastic. Much appreciated. I'm sure I'll see you again. Let's go back in here find out what was in that chest because okay then I'm gonna have to go get mushrooms and heal up because I'm down to a nine hit points out of 14 what do you mean not enough free space not enough free space for what what the hell is in there oh I had to move it. nice shovel of the f damage plus 16 how much of damage is that holy crap can I use that I can use that. Oh, fantastic. That's good. And there's the shovel just hanging in midair <laughs> in front of me. Uh-oh. Come here. Let me hit you. Okay. Oh, man. I, I took some damage there. The problem with the shovel is, of course, it's slow, right? As you would expect. Okay. So, anybody over here? Let me turn. Oh, another doorway. Great. What the hell? Okay. Okay, I heard something. Oh, you! Okay. Okay, I'm down to three hit points. Perfect. This is great. Well, if I die, I die. What are you going to do? Hello. Not enough free space. Of course not. Why would there be free space? Hmm. There, I teleported out because... Screw that idea. Okay, let's get rid of... The sword. And now i got to go and get some mushrooms and heal up. Hello, Farmer Jane. You gave me four mushrooms and I give you a shield. Oh, 
Well, that sounds like a deal. But I actually, I actually have to eat some mushrooms because I am really badly hurt. Okay. Mushrooms of teleportation and regular mushrooms. Good. See, that's great because you don't have to leave whenever you... I suppose you're inside a real dungeon, not just a house. You can, you can hop in... Uh, you can hop back to the village by just eating a mushroom or what have you, right? So, so that's handy. I like that, uh, I like that, uh, that method, actually. Cool. Oh, look, somebody left their uh, lawnmower here. <laughs> or whatever this is. Yeah, looks like somebody's not sleeping comfortably in the grave either. Hey there, buddy. How you doing? Okay. Well, good talk. You just be you. boy. You too, huh? And you guys are getting down and dirty there <laughs> in the graveyard. Anyway. So anyway, that's Drunjan. That's just the first few minutes of the game. I don't want to get too deeply into it because I know how boring it can be for some people to watch RPGs and turn-based stuff and what have you. I enjoy it, but I mean, I enjoy it in my off time, not not doing it for Let's Plays. Anyway, so so that's Drunjan. You know, that that's it's fun. It's it's uh it is what it is. It's a uh, Dungeons of Ink and Paper, and that's exactly what it is. You you fight paper monsters. You go through paper environments, and uh, yeah. So I'm sure there's a lot more to it. In fact, I know there's a lot more to it. I know there's several hours of play here. But I just wanted to go in and show it to you and also to do something very simple on my first uh, video back to doing Let's Plays. I'm going to be doing much more Let's Plays than uh, than I did in the past. I'm going, to try to, I'm going to try to do one every day, but I probably won't. But I'll try to do at least three to four a week. And uh, I know I have a tiny channel. I doubt very much I'll ever even reach 1,000 subscribers. I'd love to, but that is what it is. But anyway, so that's Drungeon. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Take care of yourselves and bye for now.